because I'm Nick aka The One Nick's Games, and today I'm going to be talking about why I haven't been uploading Minecraft videos. Now there's a real good reason for this, and it's the reason that this computer behind me, that one, is dying. It is dying so bad it's not even funny. I'm losing RAM on it, the RAM is deteriorating, as well as the graphics card is slowly going kaput. So I can't play Minecraft anymore, but that doesn't mean I can't make Minecraft how-tos and videos like this. But I've got a special in store for you. I just ordered my gaming PC. I was wanting to wait off until about June to buy this, but I don't have a choice. I have to make Minecraft videos, I have to make indie game videos, I have to make PC gaming videos, and without a computer, I can't do that. So what I did was I just bought my PC. It should be here by the end of the week. I've then got to assemble it, and there will be some videos coming out of that. I've got to assemble it, I've got to build it, and all that stuff, but Minecraft videos should resume late next week, if not the week after that. So late next week, early the week after that, Minecraft videos will resume, as well as I'll be able to finally start working on that 24-hour Minecraft spectacular video that I promise you guys whenever I hit 10k subs. By the way, we just passed 12.5k. That's incredible. Thank you guys very much. But that is why I haven't been making Minecraft Let's Play videos, because my computer has just literally died. It is dying, and it's all it can do to record how-to videos, much less record an actual gaming video. So what I'm going to try to do until I get my new PC built is I'm going to play Indie Game Spotlight on my Xbox, I'm going to do some indie games on there, and I'm going to do more gaming content as far as Call of Duty and Halo and things like that. As much as I'm trying to get away from that stuff, I don't really have a choice right now. I'm also going to do more tutorials than ever before. I'm going to do a tutorial a day, probably even after I get my new PC. I'm going to try to start doing a tutorial every single day for you guys, so I hope you guys will enjoy that. But nevertheless, that's where the gaming content is. That's why you've not been seeing daily gaming content, because how my channel schedule works is there should be gaming content every single day, like a video game on the screen with me playing it every single day. But I can't do that if I can't play Minecraft, and my PC can't play Minecraft right now. But, like I said, my new gaming PC will be here by the end of this week and should be built by mid-next week and uh, we should have Minecraft videos resuming then. It'll be awesome. I hope you guys will enjoy the videos of me building my PC, getting everything together, the hardships and things like that that will come along with building your own PC. I'm actually excited for all of those, as well as actually having a good computer again. I've got the 4 gigabyte 760 in my new PC that I'm building, and that is going to be amazing because I've never had a gaming graphics card. And that computer right back there that I've been doing videos on for the past three years, that computer is an Intel Graphics HD 3000, guys. 512 megabytes of VRAM. I'm going from 512 to 4 gigs. So that's a big difference. It's also got an Intel i5 processor running 2.5 gigahertz. I said fuck that. I'm for the i7 in my new computer that is overclockable to 4.5, I think, and comes stock at 3.7 gigahertz. So I went all out. It will blow this thing out of the water, and I am most definitely glad I went ahead and made this purchase. It's kind of, I think, fate. I feel like this will help my channel so much. I'll be able to make so many more videos so much more quickly. I mean, right now, it takes me an hour to render out a five-minute how-to video because my computer's dying. Previously, that would have been a really easy video to render out, but because that thing is deteriorating and slowly becoming slower and slower, it's not going to render it out as fast anymore. With this new PC, a five-minute Minecraft how-to should literally render out in probably about 10 minutes. Um, I've been looking at different specs online as to how quick video time render is on the 4 gigabyte 760 NVIDIA card, but nevertheless, enough of the PC talk. That's why I haven't been making Minecraft videos. They should resume late next week, early the week after that, so there you guys have it. Basically what I'm saying is next week there will most definitely be a Crisis Craft in there might be a Classic Craft, probably not though. The week after that there will be a Classic Craft and a Crisis Craft and a special Monday Minecraft video? So that's something that's going to be happening as well. But I need my new computer to do that and now all we are doing is waiting and it sucks because I just spent 
$1,300 on a computer and now I have to wait for the parts to get here to start putting it together and getting shit going. So that's those guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Sorry for no Minecraft videos. Do you have a gaming PC? That is today's question of the day. Let me know in the comment section down below. I will be a proud owner of one, as I've said many times later this week and it is going to be amazing i can't wait i'm so excited if you can't tell anyway guys hope you enjoyed this video i'm nix games and i'm out peace and here's some videos you guys might want to go check out on the left is what's new in minecraft 1.7.9 that is a video where i break down exactly what mojang did in 1.7.9 why it's important and what it means for you go check out that video also check out the video on the right which is a blast from the past on halo 3 in which i go back play some halo 3 it's fun it's awesome I had a great time, and I think you'll have a great time watching that video as well. Also, check out my daily vlogs in the bottom center of your screen. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out. Peace.